here we are once again in Crusader of Cincy. Today we're heading into Burn Daisy of the Past to do something. Honestly, there's not a lot to this. The only big difference is, well actually the only difference is that the dodo bird, or the previously burnt bird, is now alive. We can rescue him. Which is good because we're going to need his help. And we'll need him for a few golden apples along the way too. Dodo joins the group. His ability is to make things stick to your sword. That includes golden apples. But more immediately, it includes that dummy thing we couldn't access earlier. Which is right here. Yep. Another dungeon finished. Just gotta kill the boss. Okay, to trigger the boss, you just need to have Dodo on and have to grab the torso of the little puppet. That'll piss him off. Okay, there are two phases to this boss. Uh, first, he's going to dangle the puppet in front of you and make it dance around. Oh, like that. Okay, now this can be tricky though because he's only weak to certain things. I don't exactly remember which it is. It's obviously not the sticky sword. Okay, let's try... Well, maybe no elemental. Straight up hitting him with the sword. Uh, nope, that doesn't work. Uh, flaming sword. Oh, missed him. Oh, got a little time. Yeah, that's working. Okay. And next is he's going to race around to find his parts. And I like to use the strongest ice magic here because it hits him for a few points and it keeps you from having to do this over and over again, which can get really boring. If you miss, like that. Fortunately, the strongest ice magic works against his puppet, too, so... He kills it one hit, too, which is really handy. Come on, hit him! Oh, this is going to take forever. Okay. I think he goes for the torso first. Let's try to... Yeah, okay, there we go. Okay. Okay. We can this, just, we got the pattern down. Okay. Yeah, he always goes with the torso and the head first, so... That gives me some angle I can hit him with. Um, I think he's flying out of range. I feel like if I can hit him with anything here. Ah, oh, dang it, missed again. Let's let him float back down into our battle area, because, uh... Yeah. <laughs> and a little closer. Okay. Oh, okay, you can hit him just as he's, as he's still going down. Okay. That's handy. One or two more hits should take care of him. Oh, here's his puppet. Got him. Okay, Benjamin's maximum. Okay, got more health. And... All of his creations. His creations like the walking stumps and the caterpillars. Not much of an evil wizard, but eh, whatever. Okay, as you can see, the uh, the entrance is gone now, too. I want to say, though, I think the monsters are still here. Oh, let's get the... yeah. Cheat it back on so we can make this a little faster. Cheat on Leviathans because it's sort of my default. I don't see any monsters. Let's try it from the other end. It should be a little closer there. Uh, no real impact in this area. Apparently he didn't create the slimes. Just the caterpillars and the tree stumps and the weird flaming slash ice pigs. Let's see. I think... Yeah, we will run into some of them by now. Yeah. Yeah, the monsters are actually gone. Well. I'd like to think of some of the other king soldiers who's pulled that off. I've actually solved the monster problem. Okay. Well, to be fair, I had the, you know, the aid of time travel, which... In any other game would probably come back and bite me in the butt, but, uh... 
Not here. Nope. <laughs> Let's see. And yeah, I think there's like a there's a gold apple here we can get. Now that we have the dodo. I believe it's on the first bridge, might be the second bridge. Oh, I think of fire dragons. Forgot how annoying these guys are. Okay. Let's get ready to get them. And I missed. This is just not a good day for me. There. Okay. Oh, well, we need to do this anyway. Okay. Moving over. And. Oh. And I missed again. Come on, come on, go on, get him. And good. Okay. Believe, yeah, it's the second bridge. That's the, that's the one where they uh, right here. Okay. Uh, okay, right there. We'll be able to jump it. Let's try it. Uh, nah, nah. Just stick with the dodo. Maybe if we butterfly and dodo. Yeah, let's do it from the side. It might be a bit easier. Over here and no. That just occurred to me. I probably should have um, just angled it around the top of that, but oh well. And not quite. But hang on, there's, let's do it this way. Uh, first, let's get rid of these stupid fire dragons. Uh, let's get the, yeah, you know, movement or, yeah, movement. Okay. Oh, come on, that was close enough. Okay, got that one. I uh, missed, okay. There, okay. Now let's just use the moa and the butterfly. And for that, we should, it should be a, should, let me allow me to control the sword, and I can see exactly where it is. Okay. I've got that. Uh, butterfly, and no, no, I need, yeah, here we go. Okay, six, seven down, seven down should do it. Okay, so let's put the dodo -do -do back on. The dodo. -do -do. Okay. Yes. Seven. Yeah, it's, it should be seven. Oh, yeah, here we go. Let's put the dodo on here and just have it automatically. Yep. There we go. <laughs> Give it a little cheap, but you know what? It worked. So let's go. Okay, back to Cheetah and Leviathan for speed and speed of throwing. I think we're done here. No more treasure, no more golden apples. Okay. It uh, looks like we're heading back. Oh, yeah, look, there's a tornado. An enemy beach again. But uh, first, I want to go back into the hot daisy. Oh, sorry, burn daisy. I think there's a gold, uh, ch gold chest I missed. Let's jump over this. Oh, right. Uh... Okay, so we killed the sorcerer, and there's no cave here anymore. Okay, well, I hope uh, there was no gold in that. Moving back on to uh, an enemy beach. Okay, which we will pick up with next time.